Okay, hey guys, Ducky Tutorials here, and today I'm gonna be teaching you how to put a watermark on your video using Photoshop and Sony Vegas. Yeah! Techie Tutorials is brought to you by techietutorials.blogspot.com. Please go and check it out because it has been revamped and new categories have been added for your entertainment. Okay, so this is what it's going to look like. Or this is what my one is going to look like. The one in the bottom corner. It's like a little badge, tech tutorials. Yeah, okay, that's about it. So what you're going to want to do is, first of all, we're going to open our Photoshop. And we're going to go to New. And actually, we're going to make it about... I'm going to make mine 150 by 150. Or smaller. Mine was a bit too big at 300. So yeah, and what we're going to do first is you can choose a transparent background or not. Um, but what the way I'm going to show you is going to be kind of easier. You're going to pick a color like a uh, kind of a bright green or a, a blue or you know um, chroma key colors like you'd see on green screens. And then what we're going to do is we're going to just make our design. So I've chosen a little shape. It's one of these. I think I'll choose this one this time. And um, yeah, we're just going to create our watermark. You can follow me if you like, or you can just use the principles I'm using. Now, I don't want that to be that color, so hold on. I'll just go to a color overlay and we'll make this black. And then we're going to insert some text. Okay, we're going to put in some text. <coughs> Horse. Uh, so we're going to make it what I'm going to make it white T E C H Y bit big okay make these are twenty six and uh, I I'm missing the letter right sorry I'll see to this or fast forward to it Okay, let's go. Okay, so we're gonna smaller again. 30 should do. Oh, I'm trying to get the fit on the pretty much. Okay, make it 18. Make it 18. Okay, sorry, I used a different size earlier. So, okay, okay. Okay, so that's just my watermark, basically. Uh, going to put a color overlay. Make it red, why not? Outer glow. Put a nice white glow on it. Okay. That's good, just doing this quickly. I'm going to put an outer glow on my shield as well, which you may not be able to see now, but once we chroma key out the green, we will be able to see a small little bit. Okay, so this is my finished watermark. You can spend however long you want on it. Now, what we're going to do is go to File, Save for Web and Devices. We're going to make sure it's as JPEG and you can make it the maximum quality. And we're going to click Save. Now I'm going to name it the TD. Okay, we've got our watermark, now we're going to go into Sony Vegas, and, okay, let me just get rid of my watermark. Okay, so we're going to open up, okay, here's my watermark. Now, so we put in the green background so we can actually chroma key it out, so you're going to drag down any, any one of them, and we're just going to reduce the threshold, and we're going to choose say pink or purple, just a completely different colour. Now, so what we're going to do is get the eyedropper tool and select our green. Now we just move up the high threshold and you can adjust the low threshold also if you would like to. And you can keep doing that until you get the results that you want. And once you have that done, you can blur this moment here, maybe. Now I'm going to zoom my picture out or my watermark to an appropriate size because this will be going at the bottom right corner of our screen 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 or wherever you want it to go but ideally it should be fairly small just not to take up too much space now I'm going to use the track motion over here this button um, to move around my watermark to place it where I would like it to go and that's good for me. Now you can see that we have our watermark here, we have our footage. 
and usually what we will do for a watermark is we, we, will, ra uh, we will lower the opacity to about 50% and then when you play your video you can still, tr you can still see through your watermark um, but yet it's still there and very visible. Say if there's anybody out there experienced in HTML and writing blogger templates and dra JavaScript um, please send me an email. There's a link below in my pants. It's exciting. But your cursor is in my pants right now. Or in the <laughs> in the underbar. And um, there's an email there that you can contact me by. If there is anyone, I'm not really expecting anyone. If there is anyone out there, just give me an email. And uh, yeah. Alright guys, thanks very much for watching. Subscribe if you liked it. And stay tuned.